Welcome back to Verify Giant, your go-to source for helping you shop online safely. Today, we're diving into California Camping Village in Montalto di Castro, Italy. Hold on to your tent pegs, folks. First off, let's talk about the location. Nestled along the Lazio coast, it's surrounded by an ancient pine forest. Sounds picturesque, right? But let's not sugarcoat this picnic, the beach can get packed like a can of sardines during peak season. I guess you can't always have your beach and eat it too. Now, onto the rooms. The campground boasts glamping options and separate bedrooms. Some reviews mention that the beds feel more like a trampoline than actual beds, great for kids, maybe not so much for adults. One user said, I felt like I was sleeping on a medieval torture device. Ouch. As for amenities, there are outdoor swimming pools and a private beach, perfect for sunbathing and pretending you're in a James Bond movie. But watch your step. Another guest noted, the pool was nice until I discovered it was a little too natural. Nature calls, but we prefer our swimming a bit more chlorinated. Food-wise, the village offers local Italian cuisine, but if you're expecting Michelin star dining, think again. It's more like can I have my pizza without the mystery meat? One happy customer said the pasta was delightful, reminding them of their Italian nonna's cooking. But the next review was a letdown, I ordered a burger, and it was so dry, I thought it was a desert. Staff friendliness? Here's where it gets mixed. One review praised them for being warm and welcoming, while another complained about them being as friendly as a brick wall. So, it's a real toss-up. Now for the scoring. Location, 7 out of 10. Room quality, 4 out of 10. Facilities and amenities, 6 out of 10. Food and dining, 5 out of 10. Cleanliness, 8 out of 10. Wi-Fi and connectivity, 6 out of 10. Price, 7 out of 10. Security, 7 out of 10. Food and beverage options, 6 out of 10. That gives us a total score of 56 out of 100. So, is it worth visiting? If you're looking for an average camping experience where your glamping tent might bounce you out of bed, it's a yes, but only just. Otherwise, maybe consider a hotel without a trampoline effect.